question we are handling is in selling an article for rupees 76, there is a profit of 52 percent. If it is sold for rupees 75, the profit percentage will be A 44, B 46 percent, C 48 percent, D 50 percent. So this is a cost price and selling price problem. It is also made as a profit and loss problem. So what happens is whenever the cost price and selling price, selling price will always be equal to selling price will always be equal to cost price plus profit in case I make profit. Selling price will be equal to cost price minus loss in case I make loss. So this is the Bible for all your cost price and selling price problem. This is the Bible for all your cost price and selling price problem. There is nothing more than this. But by default, if I say default means here it is just mentioned at 52 percent nothing else is mentioned so whenever it is mentioned like this the profit percentage is always on cost similarly loss percentage is always on cost see here what i am going to do is if they are selling an article of 70 at 76 means the selling price is 76 as per this formula the selling i am applying it 76 will be equal to the cp i don't know so will be equal to cp and this is, he is making a product of 52 percent mint, it will be 52 by 100 of CP. Don't just write it as 52 by 100. If I say 52 percent, it is just 52 by 100 of CP. Now, when you total this, 76 will be equal to, see LC will be 100, 100 CP plus 52 CP, LC is 100. So, this will be 100 CP plus 52 CP will be equal to 152 by 100 of CP. This will be equal to 152 by 100 of CP. Now once you solve this, if 76 is equal to 152 by 100 of CP, you can score it out. See what will happen if this will get cancelled out. This will be 1 and this will be 2. This will get cancelled, this will be 50 or CP will be equal to 50. Now that I know my cost price is 50, the question is, if it is sold for rupees 75, the profit percentage will be, see the cost price is 750, the formula remains the same, SP will be equal to CP plus profit, so my SP will be 75, CP I know is 50, then plus profit. So when I work it out, profit will be equal to 25, profit will be equal to 25, so the profit percentage, profit percentage, profit percentage, percentage will be profit divided by cost into 100 profit divided by cost into 100 so profit is 25 the cost price is 50 divided by 100 so will be equal to 52 percent profit the answer is 52 percent profit so this is the way of doing it but once you understand how this is being done this is very simple you don't have to do all this working so here what is happening you see here this 76 is 152 of something. This 76, I am adding 52 percent means it will be 100 plus 52. If 76 is 152 of something, what is 75? If 76 is 152 of something, 152 of x, then what is 75? Your chain rule and cross multiplication is applicable here. So it will be 152 divided by 76 into 75 of x. This will be equal to 150 of x. So what is happening is out of 100, 50 is getting extra. So it is 50% profit. The answer is 50% profit. This is shortcut of doing it. First is understand how to do like this. Then apply like this where you don't have to find out the cost price. You can just give the answer as 50%. So keep on following this channel. I will be adding questions every now and then. Whatever comments you write, I will definitely be happy to implement it. Wish you all the best.